We'll compare the arsenals of the United States and Russia. Missiles are a critical component of modern military strategy, providing nations with the ability to project power across vast distances. Today, we'll focus on the most formidable missiles in the arsenals of these two global powers. They're intercontinental ballistic missiles, ICBMs, and submarine-launched ballistic missiles, SLBMs. U.S. Missile Arsenal the United States fields a robust nuclear triad with several standout missile systems. First, the LGM 30G Minuteman III ICBM, operational since the 1970s, has a range of 13,000 kilometers, capable of striking nearly any target on Earth. Next, the UGM 133 Trident II SLBM, launched from Ohio-class submarines, has a range exceeding 11,300 kilometers. It can carry up to eight warheads, each with a yield of 475 kilotons, and is renowned for its pinpoint accuracy of 90 to 120 meters CEP. Finally, the long-range hypersonic weapon, LRHW, represents the U.S.'s push into next-generation technology. With a range of over 2,776 kilometers and speeds exceeding Mach 5, this system is designed for rapid, precise conventional strikes, offering flexibility in modern warfare scenarios. Russian Missile Arsenal Russia's missile arsenal is equally formidable, with systems designed for both power and flexibility. The RS-28 Sarmat ICBM, nicknamed Satan-2, is a standout with a range of 18,000 kilometers, the longest of any missile today. It can carry up to 15 nuclear warheads or hypersonic glide vehicles, travels at Mach 20, and is silo-based for rapid response. Its massive payload capacity makes it one of the most destructive missiles in existence. The RS-24 Yars ICBM is a road mobile system, making it harder to detect and target. With a range of 12,000 kilometers, it carries three to four warheads of 300 kilotons each. Its mobility enhances Russia's strategic resilience, allowing it to adapt to various threat scenarios. On the submarine front, the R-29RMU-2 Laner SLBM, deployed on Boré-class submarines, has a range of over 11,000 kilometers and carries four 500 kiloton warheads. With an accuracy of 250 meters CEP, it provides Russia with a stealthy and reliable second strike option. Let's compare these arsenals. In terms of range, Russia's Sarmat leads with 18,000 kilometers, outpacing the Minuteman the Three's 13,000 kilometers, and the Trident II's 11,300 kilometers. For payload, the Sarmat's capacity for up to 15 warheads surpasses the Trident II's 8 and the Minuteman III's single warhead. The Yars, with 3 to 4 warheads, offers a balanced capability. Speed sees the Minuteman III slightly ahead at Mach 23 compared to the Sarmat's Mach 20, while the LRHW's Mach 5 Plus is notable for its hypersonic profile. Accuracy is where the U.S. shines, with the Trident II's 90-120 to 120 meter CEP outperforming the Laner's 250 meters and the Minuteman III's 200 meters. The Sarmat's accuracy is not publicly specified. Delivery platforms are diverse. The U.S. relies on silos and submarines, while Russia adds mobile ICBMs like the Yars for flexibility. The LRHW introduces a new dimension of rapid conventional strikes, complementing the U.S.'s nuclear capabilities. Conclusion Russia and the United States maintain some of the world's most powerful missile arsenals, each with unique strengths. The RS-28 Sarmat's range and payload make it a formidable weapon, while the Trident II's accuracy and stealth, alongside the emerging LRHW, highlight U.S. technological prowess. The RS-24 Yars adds mobility to Russia's arsenal, ensuring strategic resilience. These capabilities underscore the delicate balance of power and the critical need for diplomacy to prevent conflict.